If I had to describe how being trunks makes me feel in one word, powerful. Yo, this is really trunks, yo, this is nice. Dragon Ball Z all the way, turn up. Three years ago, South African-born Julian Lowe started on a mission to transform himself into his favourite anime character. Dragon Ball Z itself is one of the most intense, in-depth anime cartoons I've ever watched. When people see me dressed as trunks, uh, I only ever get uh, wow faces. I absolutely love it. I like trunks a lot because uh, I feel I I am very much like him in terms of his character. I overall, I just love his his attitude, his his charisma, his dress sense, uh, his hairstyle, and the way that he he talks. So I've got a lot of uh, Dragon Ball Z and Trunks memorabilia. Let me show you some some of the things that I've got. I was very much a daydreamer at school. I got made fun of a lot. I, I guess you could say I was somewhat of a weakling. Uh, I kept very much to myself. I mean, Dragon Ball Z itself, it was my escape. This little figurine over here, I've had for 12 years. Basically, he's, he's got the same dress sense that I like, the same hairstyle that I've always wanted, and he's just got that attitude and that swag that basically any teenage rebel would kill for. To complete his look, Julian follows a strict eating and exercise regime. To become like the Trunks Saiyan, I start my day off with uh, the most nutritionally balanced, energetic breakfast possible. Over here is my supplement stash for basically my training regime. This smoothie consists of oatmeal, egg whites, blueberries, a little bit of chocolate flavored whey protein, chia seed powder, pure cinnamon and vanilla extract. All done. And so breakfast begins. I kept hearing people say that the look of the Dragon Ball Z character was almost impossible to create. And I thought I was gonna make something impossible become possible. Time to go train. Dude, what an awesome day. Yeah. Trunks has got a very dominant upper chest and that's an area that I paid specific attention to three, four days a week. Um, I added a lot of gymnastic training in, I, I added a lot of ballet training in for my alignment, for the flexibility. Um, I went to parkour training and I cut back a little bit on the weight training and focused more on full body calisthenic training. It was a difficult process. I'm going to become this character and I'm going to adopt his facial expressions, the euphemisms that he uses, the, the language he speaks, the way he talks. And it's not just diet and exercise that Julian will be using to transform into his idol. Today he's getting his hair dyed to complete the look. I would say I spend a minimum of 5000 a year to look like trunks. I have never had anyone with this request before. Uh, you know, I like something that's a little bit uh, more different than like the average day's work. I mean, here in Beverly Hills, we just do lots of typical blondes and um, perfect cookie cutter type of looks. And mixing it up with like uh, purple hair on a guy is pretty cool. Right now, while I'm getting my hair done, I feel like I'm transforming already. I would say it, it was costly in the terms of the time and the effort, but I, I wouldn't have had it any other way. I'm transformed. I'm exactly where I need to be. Thanks to everyone here, thanks to Miguel. My pleasure. This is the real life trunks from Dragon Ball Z. When I'm dressed like Trunks, I feel really powerful, I feel very charismatic, I feel really cool and chilled, and I feel like I'm ready just to go and make people overwhelmed and smile. I'm coming down here to Hollywood Boulevard to show off my Trunks outfit and my hair. 
We're gonna see what the fa the fans and the tourist reactions are. Do you know who he is? Yes. Yo, oh. this is <laughs> outfit. Can I get a f***ing? Yo, this is really trunks, yo. This is nice. Dragon Ball Z all the way. Turn up. Yeah. Hey, no, no, no. Guys, you got a sword Oh, holy Thank you. I just get out of here. Yo, that's the coolest I've ever seen in my life. I don't think you could look really any cooler. So the fact that I've, I've surpassed that in in, in a human form, uh, it really makes me feel like happy that uh, I've stuck towards a goal and I feel completely fulfilled.